why the promotions of body perfections and beauty standards we see today makes great source of motivations. More often than not, it is the cause of the extensive discouragement and hence failures amongst people within the world of fitness. Most people will never achieve their dream body. That's a fact. Not because they can't put in the work, nor that they are incapable, but because their idea of a perfect body is so often skewed towards unrealistic expectations that can never be achievable by most. What they see, what they want, and what they're enticed to are unknowingly to them the products of what is extrapolated and advertised within the fitness industry. The image of what is seemingly impossible is now perceived as practically possible everywhere. The notion of what is simply a fantasy is now pushed as an achievable reality for everyone. Those who have taken for granted of these idealistic perceptions as part of their own world are often emotionally and mentally clouded of what actually exists out there and what may lie ahead of them within their fitness journey. Most only get to see the finishing line, not the track, nor the obstacles. Most don't understand what fitness really even is, not to mention realizing the influence of the genetic factors, the upbringing, the level of experience in determining their ability to achieve. Most don't even know what they are doing or what they are getting into and the susceptibility to demotivations and to quitting amongst people are precisely because of these very reasons. Worse, they adopt and follow guidances that deceitfully leads them to nowhere or to a place that is even darker than where they were before. Much of these failures within the fitness world can be contributed to the selling of false hopes and promises. What people today are exposed to is essentially the end products of a transformation a lifelong journey that is hidden away under the displays of success, often sold along with a six-week program and some sort of fat loss products or diet. With the likes of Instagram models and fitness influencers using the power of social media, mass delusion is injected into the minds of millions. Every day, thousands of half-told stories are published on the internet, advocating for the ideal body image to every man and woman with the possibilities of obtaining them, no matter the conditions or their circumstances. This is the reality of the fitness world today, an industry filled with deceptions and illusions that are only setting up failures for the majority. But yet, to solely blame the way these businesses operate, is again no different than deceiving individuals with half a truth. The matter of fact is, people are often sold and told what they want to hear and not what they need to hear, for they don't want to hear what needed to be heard anyway. Face it, as human beings, we like things that confirm our biases and our beliefs. Naturally, we prefer to live with the comfortable and avoid the uncomfortable. Innately, we follow the law of least effort, meaning we appeal more to promises that give quick success rather than solutions that tell us the whole truth, precisely because the truth is often uncomfortable, unmotivating, and undesired. Hence why people are so absorbed with shortcuts and quick fixes towards the attainment of their dreams. The magic appeal that solves it all the best existing program out there, the most effective products available, all to help them achieve what they want and whenever they want it. To only realize that none of that ever exists, nor even matters, as soon as they step a foot onto the treadmill or into the gym. 
most will very quickly find out that no amount of promises, no motivations, no delusion can bring the result that they want because what they desire is unrealistic and that most do not have the patience and the discipline required to push themselves every single day. This is the harsh reality for many people stepping into the world of fitness. And either you can ignore it and let yourself fail miserably when it catches up to you, or you can start to accept it and be realistic with yourself and decide if you really want to do this or not. No one can promise you anything in fitness except yourself. And you can still desire to live up to your dream as much as you want. But understand that there's no free lunch, nor such a thing as a magical pill that fix it all. To look like an athlete, you have to live like an athlete. To look like a bodybuilder, you have to live like a bodybuilder. To look the best of yourself, you have to live up to the best of yourself, and that is the best of who you can be. Even then, what may be achievable for others may only remain as a fantasy for you. And as depressing as it may sound, this is the realities you have to recognize and many times accept. Whether that should motivate or weakens you, it ups to you. Because knows that none of this matters anyway if you don't eternally desire an eternal change within yourself. There's a reason why the journey is so short-lived for most people. Too many strive for the physique that they see and think that everybody else want and deem as desire. Yet this is exactly why most people fall short, because they don't do it out of genuine desire for themselves in the long run. Real change works from the inside. If you don't change your mindset, you won't change anything else. The only one and true secret to fitness success is in defining and having that purpose that fuels the fire within you, that keeps you going every single day. It is likely already exists. You just need to go look for it. And more often than not, you will find it by looking inwards towards the person that lives within you. All right, that's the message for today. Like, comment, subscribe. And let me know down in the comment what you think about the messages. Alright, see you in the next video. Peace.